Okay, here we go. Division two, 189 pounds. We got Jeremy Foster, Pemberville East, with their second finalist today. Versus Cody Magum of Oak Harbor, their third finalist today. Oak Harbor with two champs already, and Kirk Tank and Keith Witt. And Pemberville East with Eagles with state champion Eric Coverley. So Foster wins. It's a pair of champs for both schools. Magrum wins. O'Carver gets the trifecta. O'Carver locked up the runner-up finish with the, I believe, the tank victory over Kobe Boyd earlier. I believe there's been two meetings between these two this year. Both being won by Magrum. A 4-1 decision last week in the district final by Magrum. And they met in a dual meet as well, which was a win by Magrum. Foster, fourth as a freshman, did not place last year or two years ago. And was third last year in Magrum's weight. The week before he defeated Magrum in the district final, eight to nothing. Magrum came back and won the state title. The Thompson of St. Paris Graham Love. Magrum, seventh as a freshman. Champ as a sophomore, Division 271. Champ as a junior, Division 271. Magrum tank and wet all, coached by George Bergman. Bill Scherf, assistant coach. Wood and Magrum were both junior high state champions. No score as of yet. So we're going to go 0 0 into the second period. Maybe another tight match between these two. Looks like it's going to be Magrum's choice. He's going to defer. Foster's going to start the second period in the down position. Foster up right away, shoots up like a rocket. Magrum's having a hard time keeping Foster on the net. It's only been nine seconds run off the clock. Here in the second period, taking him out of bounds twice. Foster tries crazy roll. Magrum on top. Foster does not look like he wants to be held down at all. Magrum with a double arm bar on. Double arm bar on Foster. Foster looks like he's gonna snake one out. Foster with the reversal. Two nothing, Jeremy Foster up on top. Magrum in the bottom position.
Got about 35 seconds remaining here in the second period. Foster riding tough on top with the reversal over Magrum. Stamming, they're going to put him back in the center. 21 seconds remaining. Twenty-one second remains. We're going to have either blood and or injury time on one of these athletes. Trying to come out. Foster runs him out. Smart by Foster. Foster winning. 2 nothing. 14 seconds left. Magrum looking for a third title. He would join, Be join Ben Jordan today. Magrum trying to come out. Stalling on Foster. Wow, Magrum hustled. Got the one. 2-1. End of the period. Magrim's going to go in the down position. Foster with a stalling warning as well. Might have been a situation where Foster may have wanted to cut his losses. Except like we're going to go optional start. Jeremy Foster. Knots it up. 2-2. Two, two. Minute 55 seconds. We found out who the state champion, Division 289 is. Magrum in on a quick shot, looking for the score. Foster tries to hip over. Magrum now on a head inside single, looking for a takedown on the edge of the mat. Whoa, two point takedown. Cody Magrum, edge of the mat, makes the score 4 to 2. These two schools about half an hour apart. So for the Oak Harbor Rockets tonight, many familiar foes. Tank won a rematch from last year where he was pinned convincingly and dominated by Kobe Boyd to turning the tables to pinning Kobe Boyd in overtime. And Keith Witt with his fourth victory over Danny Michaels and Clyde. School's about 20 minutes apart. Got the arm bar again. Following these matches, we will be giving out awards. Running it hard, a lot of pressure on Foster's shoulder. We ask all those place winners to be in the award staging area, please. Minute five seconds remains. Foster's down. Magger him up four to two. Looking for number three. Laces it up again. Got the far hand. Stalling call on Magrum is trying to apparently work on top. Well, Carver coach George Bergman is going to argue it. Next takedown here is going to decide this match. Five seconds. Magrum and on the head outside. Foster fights it off nice. Oh. 
Got 12 seconds left. Jeremy Foster's going to have to try and make something happen here. Magrum does have a warning. Both of them have a warning. See if the Ohio officiating will prevail and they'll try and send this one to overtime. So the Ohio official breaks the cycle rather than send it to overtime. He lets it end in regulation. Three time champion Cody Magrum. Jeremy Foster. Three times state placing.